So we had gone till this particular command. Uh, new cable bay, yes. Mm -hmm. We have done this particular point with pinpoint, yes. Insert component, yes. Placing component, using point. Editing state features. This is where actually we were like held up. I think it's easy. Far better today, the performance compared to yesterday. So what happens is actually the whole thing, this particular string got stretched, whole segment got moved. Okay. So, and uh, uh, if you select, uh, you, know, you know, a feature like this, say, uh, and if you try to move this down, then you got issues because here there is a connection. And here, the, uh, the, there is a straight piece. Now, if you try to move this particular uh, component, okay not going because it's actually linked with this particular plane so whenever you're trying to move actually the you know you have to have a component like this which you can manipulate so if there is a height adjustment component available beyond that particular component then you'll be able to move yeah mm -hmm. okay. so since there is no height adjustable component it's not able to move Okay. Next kind of is actually when the leg length is not locked on remove the ends of the assistance in the same person. And charted so that yeah. so you have edit straight option you go for that. We don't have any kind of component like that, so I think we will model it.
Okay. Now this particular component here is not recognized. What I'm going to do is I'm going to change this into a miter. Mm -hmm. See what has happened. So once I change that into a miter, it has recognized. It has no more the no part found. You know what a miter is, right? Mm -hmm. So that's a miter there. Or actually you are trying to get a bend by adding fade components and bolting them at the edges. Okay? Mm -hmm. Complete circle, but you are just getting connecting multiple components. Mm -hmm. okay?